everyone, we are RetroCosal and today at Automate Show 2023 we have our newest demo of the latest Pathfinder version which is the real-time task guidance manufacturing system which allows worker to do the error-free assembly. As you can see, we have the demo station which consists of the multiple parts. So the first part is the production monitor which indicates the bill of process, the current step and the cycle time as well as the all the cycles performed before. We also have the projected piece so which projects on the surfaces or any object it could also project on the parts what needs to be picked up, where to pick up the parts and we also can upload the videos like small videos to guide worker through. The third piece we have is the monitor which indicates the integration with the MES systems. So once I will start the cycle, the virtual conveyor will stop. And once I will end the cycle, the virtual conveyor will start again. The fourth piece we have is the integration with the IoT tools. Here we have the sample tool which provides the torque using the OPC UA protocol to our system. And the last piece we have is a tower light which indicates that worker missed the step or worker finished the cycle correctly all the steps done and we can move forward let me show you the quick demo so first of all i'm going to start the cycle and the conveyor belt will stop the tower light will indicate the cycle started let me show it to you as you can see the conveyor stopped we have the cycle started the timer started and now the next step is install thermostat it also displayed here in a video format how it should be performed and let me do it as you can see i performed two steps and the next step would be tighten cylinder head and now i'm going to demonstrate to you how does the torque work with integration with our system so let me apply the apply the incorrect torque as you can see what happened just now I performed the step, but I didn't apply the correct torque. You see, so we see it in red. Let me perform the correct torque. Okay. So now, as you can see how I apply the correct torque. The system saw that they have done the step, right? And confirmed it with the value of the torque value. So as the next part of our demonstration, let me skip the step. As you can see, I skipped the step so I didn't touch it with the cylinder head. And the, the tower light signaled about that. As well as the, the production monitor showed me that we missed these steps. Thanks for watching. It was Automate Show 2023 in Detroit. We are RetroCausal. Please reach out to us at retrocausal.ai. Thank you.